What's going on, y'all? It's your boy Juggle972 back here, and welcome back to Final Fantasy VI. Now, when we last left off, we came from Albrook. From Albrook all the way to the Crescent Islands. Now, we're going to keep going forward to this little island over here. There is a town that actually has some magic users, though, but shh, you're not supposed to know that just yet. Alrighty, here we go. Welcome to Thamasa. Oh wow, strangers. I know, we are a little strange looking. And all the money that we saved up though, it's actually gonna come in handy though because there's a lot of goodies here. Now, I highly recommend, you know, buying any, any one of these. But, I'm actually gonna buy the uh, Stout Spear for, uh, oh boy, Edgar. Some darts for Setzer. Okay, but what are these rods for? We're gonna hold on to these for a little bit later. We've got plenty enough as it is anyway. What else do we got? We're gonna need some new armor. A couple of new gold sheep. You know what? A few more of these wouldn't. Ooh, tiger masks. Two TRs for the ladies. A few gold helmets. Ah, I think we're good with that. I think we're good. Alright, let's see. Hold on, let's get everybody optimized real quick. Alrighty. But what is so crazy about this place? Well, nothing absolutely crazy, but... Like I said earlier, there are magic users here. Listen, I have to tell you. Nah, never mind. Okay, you don't have to tell me anything. Alrighty. Espers, what in blazes are they? They're animals. Talk to the old guy that lives on the edge of town. Old guy, huh? Okay. Ha! No admittance. Okay, kid. Whatever. Just talking to the strange ninja. He means you no harm. So... What, what was that? As I sip my coffee... Mama, it hurts! Alright, cure. Uh-oh. Um, hello. Just don't mind me. Medicine, where is my cure medicine? Mama, please use care on me! <laughs> okay, uh, what's so scary about using magic? I know it could be bad, but... What you want with me? Hmm. An elderly gentleman, pure of heart, and learn the ways of the monsters. Strago Magus. Don't let the old man fool you. He knows a lot. Espers. Hmm. Not really familiar with that word. But you've heard of it before. Nope. Uh, I can't say I have. Honestly, I can't. Say I have. That's odd. Grandpa! Aw. He's got a granddaughter. Hey! What in places? What are you doing? In her picture, she captures everything. Forests, water, light, the very essence of life. Her, her name is Realm. Who are these people? Yeah, yeah hush. <laughs> what a cute doggy. Get away, he bites. Go to your room. <laughs> Quiet little girl. Oh, aww. Interceptor. Seems to like your dog. What a sweet puppy. I think Interceptor made a friend. This is terrible. Sorry. No problem. The dog usually doesn't like people, though. Please excuse her. 
She's just young. This is a backwater village. We can tell you nothing about your espers. I see. There's something wrong here. Let's have a look around. Thanks for your time. Sorry I couldn't have been more helpful. Interceptor, come. He's a poochie poochie. He's a poochie poochie. I like dogs too. Okay, let's have a look around. What was that? Fire! A young mage. <laughs> oh no. It seems that everybody here does use magic. Have you met Little Realm? She loves to paint pictures. I wonder what she'd do my portrait. Well, you gotta wonder. Pardon me, that was just my computer. Hmm. Okay, we've already talked to you. Old Man Strager looks like he's been on his last legs. He used to be a powerful warrior. Don't let that fool you, he still is powerful. He's gotta utilize him a little bit, though. Do so, and the innkeeper may be more reasonable. Okay, well, let's go talk to the innkeeper, then. Okay. Oh! Why not relax for a spell? Well, isn't that nice? I like how Interceptor lays next to Shadow. Okay, whoa. Huh. This is awful! Realm, she's... in danger! She was at a neighbor's house when a fire broke out. I won't be able to stand in if I... Please, won't you help? I like how Shadow stays asleep. Dude, Shadow. <sighs> Interceptor, where are you? Okay. Well, let's just lock and terror by themselves. Okay, now, just let you know right now, we are in for something pretty challenging at times. But, we're going to bring Shiva with us. And with Saffron, you know what? Hang on. Let's see. Bring, we'll keep Saffron in. Ice, Ice 2. We'll give uh, Madden to Locke. Okay, with this fire breaking out, there are some fire elemental monsters here. Uh-oh. That's not good. That's not good at, good at all. Realm! What are you doing? Flames be gone! Magic is forbidden. Magic? I don't care. Realm's inside. Yeah, that's his granddaughter. Anything for family. Mayor! Alright. We really have no choice. Stand back. You know, I was going to say Grand Wizard, though, but that sounded a little racist. <laughs> <sighs> Flames be gone! You know, magic could work though, but every now and then you just need to be a, a good old fashioned firefighter. Fire's too strong. I think because they keep so many fire rods in there. I'm going in! Wait, I'm going too. Count me in. You better stay out of here, Gramps. Oh, I may be old, but I'm not powerless! <gasps> Ooh, excuse me. Try to avoid the flames. Easier said than done. I think we may have a time limit here. With Strago here. Now, he doesn't have any magic, but he does have lore. So, here's what we're going to do. 
fucking shadow has Bismarck. Okay. Well, you know what? We're gonna bring him with uh, Saffron. We're gonna have him be our, our white mage. Oh! Now, these enemies here, these balloons, if you will, they're... Well, in the Final Fantasy world, they're called bombs. Okay, we're just gonna call them bombs. They're all fire elemental. Now, you, all, you always want to go with water and ice, but... Right now, we're just gonna work with what we have. So... An Aqua Rake is gonna be the number one uh, spell you're gonna want to use with Strago. Alrighty. Now, this is actually a really good way to level up a little, too. Monsters may be brand new. Okay, moving forward. Make like Piccolo and dodge. Damn it! Alrighty. Let's keep going. Now, there are some treasures in here, too, that you can get. Ugh. Ugh. I swear, these flames can be a little unpredictable at times. You think you know what you're going to be doing, but I don't know, like, these, these flames, you know, as random as they are, they're very, very, very good at, you know, getting at you. Okay. Okay, let's see. Ice Rod. Yes. Was going to buy one, though, but... If you ask me, though, I think we're just going to go give the Ice Rod to the old man. Keep him, keep him with a flail. Give him a mithril shield. Okay. And I think this is the problem. This is the source of our blaze. Alrighty, say hello to the flame eater. Now he's not going to be the pushover of all these little bombs up here. But, here's what we're going to do. We are just going to keep attacking, attacking, attacking. And we are going to have somebody be the healer. We're going to aqua wake. No, Aqua Rake. Yo! What's up? Take it easy. That was misunderstood, everybody. Have a good day, y'all. Take it easy. She's headed to work. Alrighty, be safe, y'all. Anyway, back to the ass kicking. Okay, let's see. Now, the uh, bomb eater is not really, really tough. But, just ice, attack, ice, and attack. Be wary, though, his fire magic is pretty powerful. Oh yeah, and that was a problem too. I forgot to take Locke's Flame Saber off. Durr. But this is really cool though, because with Terra, you can actually use Morph here. Put her in a trance ability, if that makes sense. If you play Final Fantasy uh, 9. Her magic comes in handy. Especially here though, she hits twice as hard. Alrighty. Nice two it is. Also, another thing I also like about this fight, though, it really, really puts your... really good, goes to show just how powerful you really are with your magic. And if you really have been, you know, doing the best that you can, though, it really reflects on this fight. And it's cat, casting safe. Now, safe on... oh, crap. Now, safe, on the other hand, protects against, um, physical attacks. But he's casting reflect, though, so he's gonna be reflecting our ice 2, our ice 2 attack. Now, I don't have the spell with me, but... Terra. Oh damn it! We're gonna hit. Keep hitting with Aqua Rake. Now, if you don't have uh, any kind of dispel magic, just keep hitting with Aqua Rake. That's gonna be the best. Your best bet. Bomb blitz. Alrighty. We're gonna try to muddle them real quick. Let's see what we can do with that. Oh my. I forgot about Reflect. Total dirt move. We're gonna remedy that. Take out those little bomblets. <sighs> it seems to like casting Reflect on itself though and then hitting itself with its own magic. Oh, wonderful. Oh, that's just perfect. Okay, we're gonna aqua rig it. And a grenade. Okay. Blaze. Oh yeah, that's a hard hit for you. Alright, come on, stay alive, stay alive. 
Phoenix down it is. We're going to keep using Aqua Rake. Come on, Locke. Get back up. Oh, Lord. That's not good. That is not good at all. We are on the edge of death right here, everybody. On the edge of death of flames. On the edge of death with flames all over us. Come on. Get up, 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 get up. It's going to reflect itself again. Okay. With a waste of a turn, we can recover. Cure 2 it is. Alrighty. We're going to keep ourselves healed up. Come on. Oh, fuck up, everybody. And I'm pretty sure the Flame Eater has uh, identified who the White Mage is out of everybody. You know what? Let's see what we can steal. I'm going to take a risk. I'm going to take a risk and steal it a little bit. Alrighty. Ice 2. Can't steal. You know, Locke, you're the worst thief ever. Every time I've tried to steal something with you, I have always failed. You're the worst thief ever. You know, a thief's supposed to be good at stealing. Say goodbye to the flame eater. What a pain in my ass. That's all I gotta say about that. Goodbye. Only you can prevent forest fires. In this case, only you can prevent Force Whitaker. Okay, Strago. Keep calm. Aw, oh, Interceptor's rescuing her. Woof, woof. That's a loyal dog right there. Ugh, too late! <sighs> but is it too late? Uh oh. See, if only Shadow would have actually came with us. Had a bunch of ice scrolls and all that, using that. Come on, Shadow. What are you gonna do? Dude, that was totally ninja. Come on. Let's get out of here. I'll use a smoke bomb. Oh, great. You use a smoke bomb in the middle of a fire? Yeah, that's uh, really smart. That is a little scary. I guess our town's a little secret's out now. Yeah, the secret's out. Everyone here can use magic. What's going on here? This is the village of mage warriors. Long ago, humans used magicite to gain magical powers. They came to be known as mage warriors. But I thought they perished centuries ago. After the war of the magi, the espers fled to their new world behind the sealed gate. They wished to live peacefully without the fear of being used by humans. They left us here to fend for ourselves. I sent people like us to hunt down like animals. Even though their only difference was you could use magic. That's pretty racist when you think about it. A few mage warriors escaped. Found their way here. They were our ancestors. Our powers have weakened over time. But some of it remains. We could use your help. So you're after the espers, eh? You have no idea. Well, all you want for saving realm... I'll help you find your aspers. Me too. I don't think so. What a fuddy duddy. <laughs> Where do we start looking? Hmm. If they're here, they must be hiding in the mountains to the west. They must be hiding in the mountains of the west. Those mountains have powerful magical properties. They say the aspers were created there. Maybe they're drawn to that place. Whoa, Shadow, what are you doing? I think it's worth a look. 
I like how Shadow takes off without saying bye. Yeah, your grandpa's a fuddy daddy, sweetheart. He really is. Well, we're gonna keep the flail on him. You know what? Even with the Genji glove. I'm saving that for hang on, Thunderblade. I'll give him two full moons. Alrighty. Where do we head now? Seems to me like we head to the mountains. Uh-oh. The lone wolf with his dog. Don't misunderstand me. I just wanted my dog back. Going somewhere? I'll search for the espers in my own way. There's a boochie boochie. Interceptor, come. I don't think the doggy wants to leave. Aww. But a dog is loyal. Welp, it appears that we have to go to the mountains of the east, or the west, I believe. So in the next episode, we'll pick it up right from there. Much love. We now have two new uh, party members. Well, Realm will join us a little bit later. So in the next episode, we'll pick it up from here. Much love, and peace!